everyone, we're Team Uglena Bonanza. I'm Tatum. I'm Maddie. And when we began this project, we always knew that we wanted to incorporate some kind of biological education into our game design. Originally, we designed a game that looked at the flux of Uglena inside a target region in order to determine if an objective was completed or whatnot and move on. Uh, we determined that this was a little bit too difficult for us to pull off at the time, so we did a target-based approach to the game. So, in terms of gameplay, we decided to incorporate a little more focus on the actual life uh, of the Uglena. We feel that by putting Uglena in the spotlight, we give them more respect as an organism, we kind of enhance the user's learning experience about Uglena's life. Yeah, and so we did this by making the objective targets in our game represent different essential parts of the Uglena's life. Um, for example, the cyan targets represent the water that the Uglena lives in, the yellow represent the sunlight, and the red represent harmful aspects of the Uganda's life, like pollution, predators, different toxins. Um, we hope that this gives more respect to the organism as users learn a little bit about what its life is like. Let's talk out our gameplay. Welcome to Uganda Bonanza. As you can see, as you want to swim across the screen and hit the colored target boxes, they flash white and the point value increases the according amount. The green box represents micronutrients, and the yellow box here represents sunlight that Uglana needs to photosynthesize. Here in level 3, the double point round of our game, the user is using the joystick to drive the Uglana toward the bottom half of the screen. Okay, thanks for playtesting for us, Allison. Um, basically, use the joystick left, right, up, down to control the Uglana's movement on the screen and try to hit the boxes and they get different points according to our point system. Can you tell when you score a point what happens? Yes, green seems to be going up by 10. Oh, and now you have red, which represents all of the enemies that you can possibly occur. This is level two. <laughs> is blue water? Yes. What's blue? blue is water. Stay away from red. And are you driving the Uglana right now? I am. I'm pushing them to the right. They seem to be responding. Up. Oh, level three. So in this project, we both learned a lot of skills and, and through the development of the game, we had a lot of fun. Um, I really enjoyed designing the housing for the joystick controller and doing the wiring and the fabrication of that. Uh, I enjoyed actually doing the MATLAB and the coding aspect. Um, I did a lot of troubleshooting as well and just like finding a way to make Uglana interact uh, with the MATLAB code and actually create a game. So that was really exciting. Yeah. Uh, I think I learned a lot from that and just the, pro the entire process in general. So it was great. We had a lot of fun. Yeah, integrating lots of components and yeah, good job on the detection. Yeah. <laughs>